aspirations of parliament. And we should not uh, shy away from that. In the same breath, Minority Leader at the Senate and Bungoma Senator Moses Wetangula also spoke on the same meeting with uh, U.S. Ambassador to Kenya, Robert Gordek. Let's listen into what he said. Children are fed when they cry. Democracy has no timetable. We have periods and interludes where elections are held. Every five years you go to elections. But an intervening event can bring you to elections any time. Like we held election on 8th of August. The High Court said there was no validity in the election. It was null and void. So we hope to go to elections again. But we said these elections, under the same circumstances, with the same IBC, with the same situation, with the continuing interference from NIS, will not be fair. Can we sit down and agree to some reforms and say where and how did things happen to make the Supreme Court arrive at the ruling they did? Nobody was interested. So as far as we are concerned as NASA, there were no elections on 26th of October. We still want to have elections. But that notwithstanding, any elections in the same circumstances are likely to yield the same convoluted results. So where do we begin? Let's begin by having a national conversation, a reform agenda, and say, can we reform the IEBC? Can we strengthen the judiciary so that they don't make a decision and none other than the head of state starts calling them Wakor. I'll deal with you. I'll fix you. You've had boy, young men like Murkom and saying they must bring bills to this parliament to fix and clip the judiciary. If we want to run a country where every time a court makes a decision against me, I go to change the law, then we are not a country. Because the law is the law, it cuts.